Hey, set. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we're still good? Okay, great. Well, where are we gonna go? Because I wanna go somewhere where the guys are nice. I'm so sick of these players. Okay. Yeah, yeah, good idea. Okay, yeah, let's do that. What time? Eight? Perfect. I'll see you later. Okay, bye. Bye. <laughs>
you could come over to me and have a chance with this. I don't think so, Roger. Very cruel, poor guy, and also everyone else is going to see it. So other guys would be terrified to approach, just all wrong and yeah. nasty. This isn't going to get you the outcome that you want. Yeah. What a shame. Poor guy. I mean, it's not his fault, but too many issues. I could never date a guy like that. Yeah, I see. Did you see that guy behind you? He looks really cute. Yeah, he does. Had to get his attention. Watch and learn. Maybe the wrong kind of attention here? Yeah, too sexy or the, or the wrong kind of sexy. This is how you get his attention. So this one, I'm going to say, is actually probably not bad if, uh, you know, she's looking for something casual. Really? But for a serious relationship, yeah. it's maybe not the first thing you want a guy to notice. No, I think it's going to be sending out all the wrong messages there. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. You girls seem like you're having a nice time. Like you my whole life. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, we'll take it slow. Take it slow. Yeah, drink. Crazy bitch. It's a little bit too intense. A little bit intense, a little bit insincere. Yeah, we're having a lovely evening, thanks. Cool. Cool. Uh, cool. I'll just, um, I'll get a drink, please. This is wrong because a lot of good guys are quite shy mm -hmm. and so they're going to be put off if it's too hard. I think anyone would be put off. You know, it's not good to be cold and difficult if you're looking for a relationship. But a player guy might persevere and a good guy would just think, you know what? But you're not going to get the best outcome from it. Agreed. I'm Nick. Hi, I'm Louise. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. This is my friend. Hi, I'm Sarah. Oh, nice to meet you, Sarah. I'm Nick. So, um, how many girls have you fucked in the last month, would you say? Like, just, uh, uh, like, roughly. Like, because 
Honestly, tonight, I'm out celebrating finally being clear of gonorrhea, and I want to know that you're nice and clean. Um, uh, well, none, actually, in the last month. And um, I uh, advise that you start practicing safe sex. Uh, have a nice, disease-free evening, ladies. Shouldn't have mentioned the gonorrhea, should I? Awful question. So, uh, know anywhere where we can get any of the, uh, get the Charlie? You know, the white stuff. You know, snow, you know, powder, you know? Um... You know? <sighs> cocaine, mate! Anywhere we can get any cocaine? Sure. Um... My best friend actually died of a cocaine-induced heart attack last year, so... Um... Hmm. You'd love this place. If you're looking for a serious relationship, asking for cocaine, probably not good, right? Charlotte, would you no, think? No, that's probably definitely not a good move. Who's a good person to ask for the coke in this situation? I really wouldn't know. Uh, so you girls seem quite tight. Have you been friends for a long time? or? Yeah, we've been best friends since school. Oh, nice. Yeah, I'm friends with a lot of my pals from school as well. Ah, oh, it's really cool. Yeah. You know what, Nick? I'm going to be honest with you. I'm sick to death with stupid men. What's 462 times 4? Divided by 3. Add 1. No? No. I don't think so. Thanks for your time anyway. Have a good night. Hang on. Do you know the answers to those sums? Oh. It's not the point, is it? About you. What was the first one? I can't remember. Four hundred times four divided by. Not the best way, right? To find no. out if he's intelligent. No, she could be a little bit more clever about this one. Look, Nick, um, we are so sick and tired of stupid men. Right. Um, I've got a little test. Okay. Do you mind if I do my test? No, no, not at all. Just no. test your intelligence. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah? Cool. Okay. Just relax. Okay. Okay, okay. You see, I just, I just feel the size of your balls, and, 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 and I can tell how intelligent you are. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, they're pretty good. Well done. Right. I'll give that about an IQ of a one four five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. You'll do. You heard this one, uh, Charlotte. It's quite a new scientific theory. Really? I'm... No is the answer. I've never heard of that. And I'm doubtful whether that's true science. Um, I'm a big fan of tennis. Um, I'm a musician, so I play guitar and drums. Um, I like going to watch live music. I like watching live jazz and blues. Um, I'm a big, big, big UFC fan. 
Um, just the camaraderie of it and the respect and like the brotherhood and how much they love each other. I just, I just think it's amazing. Um, it's not so much about the violence of it, it's more about, you know, the respect they have for each other. I just find it really moving. UFC, yeah? You like UFC? Yeah. <laughs> Good. Because I love a violent man. You know, my, my ex-boyfriend, he was a criminal. He was in prison and then he got out, so it didn't work anymore. But we just had the best violent sex, you know? It was like, oh God. I mean, he beat me within an inch of my life once. And I just, that, that's what I want. That's what I want. A violent, rough, hard sex, you know? You up that? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Do, 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 um, do you like cuddling and making love as well, or just... No. No. Okay, cool. Um, I'm just um, going back there. Yeah, you've co yeah, I'm coming. Never a good idea. I do not, the wing call, get away from there. Anywhere but there. Comfy? I need it. No, babe. Oh, you're joking. You're one of them. I mean, don't try and spruce it up as all fun loving and loving each other and caring about each other. UFC. It's just a load of brutes being archaic, tearing each other apart. Oh, brilliant. Yeah, what a waste of time that was. Thanks. Thanks, Nick. You've got it wrong. Completely wrong. This is bad because it's uh, blocking him. Even if you don't share his interest, you could at least find out why he likes it and, you know, listen for a little bit. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Otherwise, you're just killing the conversation. Uh huh. And do you like UFC? Um, I've actually never watched it. Do you like UFC? Yeah, I like it a lot. We always watch it. Oh, great. UFC, eh? <laughs> Well, I can tell you're just a spectator a bit. What? You go to the gym? No? Well, uh, don't worry about it, because, like, um, I train. <laughs> quite strong. But can I show you? Can I show you a little, a little move? Uh, yeah. yeah. Okay, so it goes a little something like this. Okay, okay you ready? Okay, yeah. just, 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 just keep breathing. Breathing, breathing, relax. Okay. Relax, relax, relax. Relax, relax, relax. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, we're so cute when he's sleeping. Oh. 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 This one's pretty rude, and uh, he could be a, a featherweight or a straw weight or a one of those guys, yeah? Little exactly. ones. Exactly. Just super rude. So we're out celebrating because Sarah has just ran her first marathon. Oh, yes. Congratulations. Thank That's you. great. And a whole marathon. A whole marathon. So what's that, 26 miles or something? Yeah, yeah. Get 26 miles. Amazing, isn't it's it? Brilliant. It's brilliant. It's brilliant, yeah. Oh, and she's, she's fast. I mean, really fast as well. Yeah. Probably not as fast as the kids that run away when they see you. <laughs> <laughs> what, do you what do you mean? Well, you look like a paedophile, don't you? I look like a paedophile. But no one's ever said it before. What does a paedophile look like? Well, they wear these denim shirts in prison. In America. They wear those, all the paedophiles. What and with a white t-shirt underneath. What the fuck are you and talking really, about? And they have really, really, really dodgy beards. You look exactly like a paedophile. You never knew. Wow. Wow, no one's, no, no one's ever said that to me before. Oh, uh, joke! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a good joke. <laughs> Bitch.
What do you think of that? Not a great tease, right? This is not a very funny joke. And what does a paedophile look like? I don't think they have a particular look. Hmm, it's dangerous, then. you never know. So, um, are you, uh, are you single or...? Um, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm single. Cool. Yeah? Uh, yeah. Oh, guys, you just forgot. My friend is still waiting for me outside. I've got to go. I'll call you later, dear. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna stay. Okay, no problem. Take care. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> um, cool, so we're both single, that's a good start. Mm -hmm. You seem like a really nice guy. Um, have you got your phone on you? Yeah. <laughs> can, you, uh, can you unlock it? Yeah. And um, have you got a banking app? Yeah. Thank you. Right? Yeah. 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 Just, just open the banking app. What, what's all this about? I'm confused. Because I, I want to see how much money's in your account. Just. To... <laughs> you joking? No. 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 I'm not joking. Can you imagine how many skint men I've had to put up with in my life? No. No more. Does this face look like it should be flying economy? No. Show me your banking app. No, I'm not going to show you my banking app. Show me your no. banking app! You're telling me it's important for you to know how much I earn when literally you've met me ten minutes ago. Finally, you've got the point. Now open your banking app. Not a chance. The fuck do you think you are? Pretty rude, yeah? There's something definitely wrong with that. Most definitely. Do you only like rich guys? No. Money is not important. I certainly wouldn't be looking at their bank balance. <laughs> you seem such a nice guy. <laughs> um, can I just look at your... Here a second. Um, could you just do, do this? Okay. And, um, <laughs> what shoe size are you? Uh, ten. Okay, cool. Um, how big's your, um, just show me, just, just give me an idea, like, just a rough, just a loose gauge, like, just, You want just, me to show you my card? No, 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 not yet. So just want you to give me an idea, like, is it more, or is it more? Just, just rough, just rough. Right. Just, and now this is, in, cock rough. size is important to you, is it, yeah? Well, no, I just want to know. There's a lot more to a relationship than the size of a man's cock, okay? No! I have had too many maggot willies for anyone's lifetime, okay? So I am not, I am not wasting my time again. So just, just, just give me an indication. Do you or... know what? Do you know what? You've just missed out on a really good cock. It was that, wasn't it? So Charlotte, what, what do you normally check to check? I with? don't check anything, believe it or not. No? Not no. Ears? No. Nose? No. Little finger? I don't, I'm afraid. Circumference of the wrist? Nope. I've never even heard nope. of that one. Yeah, there's certain things I really look for in a man. I like, I like a sense of humour no. and kindness. Yeah. Someone I can get along with, introduce my friends and my family and... Oh, is his family, is family important to you? Yeah, really important to me. Good. And you seem like you've got a sense of humour. Yeah. I like that. Well, it's, it seems like we've got similar values, so... Yeah, it really does. Yes, that's, that's, that's a good thing. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you.
So what's your timeline? What's my what? Timeline. I don't know what you mean. Well, six months engaged, a year married, a year and two months I want my first child, then I'm happy to go straight in and have a second because I've heard it's really good for your body just to get back in, pop one out. So um, I don't want having two in like, two under the age of 18 months, I think is acceptable. Then I think we have like a cheeky two year gap, you know, let the kids grow up, really get to know them, have a bit of family bonding time. Then we pop out another three. Then I'm thinking then like, right, okay, here's the deal. I'm happy to settle for a three bedroom house, three bedroom for the first two years, okay? okay. Then I want mansion, I want acres, I want a lake and I want a helicopter pad. I don't want anything less and if you're gonna give me less, you need to tell me now. Um, but I think it's reasonable and it's doable. Yeah. Um, listen, I'm uh, not interested in any of that. Um, so uh, I'm just gonna go. Listen, it's been nice, really nice chatting to you, though. I don't and mind sacrificing no, no, the no, helicopter pads. No, 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 it's, it's too much, and I'm not interested. Good luck with uh, all of that. Um, but I'm, I'm going. No. Take care. Come on. No, no, mate. Freaky. No, no, no kids for me. Not with you, darling. One kid. She's a bit desperate now. Yeah, a bit too intense. So I read this really interesting Harvard study and it said that 76% of women would rather their partners have um, like a one night stand rather than having an emotional connection with another person, right? Mm. But the men are completely the opposite. So 78% of men would rather their partners just have a bit of an emotional connection with someone. But if they had a one night stand or meaningless sex, what? Mental. How do you feel? Well, I think they're both as important as each other. I think an emotional connection is just as important as having great sex. I think you need both to have a successful relationship. Now, do you agree or...? Yeah, I agree. Yeah. But... But what? Why do you expect you to say that? Oh. <laughs> well... I'm like super passionate, like so, so passionate. And, and I guess some people might worry that maybe it's a bit too much. Like maybe I can get a bit jealous, but I'm not, I'm, I'm, I'm really, I'm, I, I don't get jealous. Okay. I just like, I just like to know my man is mine, you know? Um, yeah. um, and, and, and so do you have many girlfriends, like friends that are girls? Yeah, a couple, yeah. 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 Okay. Is that, that's, a, that's a problem, isn't it? It's a little it? bit of a problem, I guess, but I mean, you know, we can phase them out slowly so that they don't get offended <laughs> and upset about it. We can phase it. them out slowly. Um, family members. You have a sister, did you say? Yeah. And you have a mum? Yeah, I've got a mum. And a grandma? Yeah. Normal, like, family members, yeah. A, a great grandma? No, she died actually. And um, the grandma, she's Good. she's how old is she? Uh, my grand. What the? What? 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 We, what we doing? What is this? Look, I'm going to be honest with you. I don't want too many females in your life because let's be brutally honest. How can you love me a hundred percent? If you've right. got to give your energy out to all these females, huh? Right, well. So we can do, we can do, we can like make a little um, calendar and you can call your mum like every Can I just stop, can I just stop you right here? Can I just stop you right? All these women that you're talking about are far more important to me than you are clearly ever going to be. Wow. So this isn't going to work. <laughs> wow. All right, so good luck to the next wanker that walks through the door. Ooh. 
definite mummy issue. Then he's definitely not going to date you. Uh, do you let guys talk to other women? Yes, of course. Um, what was your ex-girlfriend's name? Uh, Catherine. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Um, what does she look like? She, so, or just, just show she, me a picture. Maybe. A picture. Okay. see a picture of my ex-girlfriend. Yeah. Really? Yeah, there's nothing weird about that. I'm easy breezy. I just like to know what I'm working with. Wow. Huh. She's blonde. Yeah. Oh, um, don't, what, don't do this. It's just... No, this is, Hello? this is ridiculous. Hello? Oh my God, this Hi, is, is ridiculous, Catherine? please. Hi, Catherine. Yeah, sorry to bother you. Just a quick one, really random. Um, I'm with Nick on a date, and I just want to talk to you. Oh, you're Nick not doing this. This is have ridiculous. Give me my phone. If, um, could you just Give tell me, me did you just buy flowers? Like, I think these are good to bed. Is he good in bed? Yeah, he's good in bed. 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 Yeah, he's good Oh, okay, that's enough. She's gone. Yeah, she's gone. Surprised, are you, that she hung up? You fucking freak. Well, that was a bit harsh. You're not going to get a girlfriend talking to people like that. I'll tell you that now. Idiot. This is psychotic, yeah? Yeah, especially this early on, in fact, ever. Yeah. Um, no, this isn't really acceptable. Never call the exes. Or message the exes. No, you shouldn't need to. All my rings are like important. They all like mean yeah. things from where I've been around the world. What's that one, mate? This one was from Malaysia. Okay. When I was backpacking when I was young. <laughs> very pretty. What's, what's this one from? This one is from Nicaragua. Wow. Yeah, pretty cool, eh? Yeah, very cool. Mm. About that one? Mm, that's just from London, where I live. Ah. Oh. So. Cool. bottle of wine and go back to mine. Yeah? <gasps> yeah. Okay. Um, do you have any, um, do you have any condoms? Oh, shit. No, I don't. No? no. Great. <laughs> Me neither. Um, so, on the way home, you know we were going to get a bottle of wine. I was thinking maybe we scrap the wine, we get some bananas and some multivitamin, you know, get your sperm really, really healthy and my eggs really ready and... Oh my God, we can have the best, the best, best time and make a baby! Should <laughs> <laughs> we go? Uh, yeah. Yeah? Uh, yeah? No. Yeah? I think, yeah. um, no, I think, um, no, I think, no, no, I'm good, yeah, um, um, for the drink? No, no, it's not good for your sperm for having another drink, yeah, um, I think, uh, ooh.
It's true you shouldn't uh, drink when you're pregnant, of but course. if you're not pregnant yet. Yeah. Yep, a little bit too intense again. Did you just ask me to come back to your house? Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck do you think I am? You think I'm some kind of prostitute, some night walker? You know, what? not even one drink, and you just asked me to come back to your house? Yeah, I, do, I just thought sort of oh, chill out. fuck yeah. off! Rick. Uh, uh. Bit too, what's, what's the problem there? A little bit too confrontational, confrontational. looking for a serious relationship. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm up for that. Yeah. <laughs> um. Do you have a condom? <laughs> um, obviously, oh, do you know what? He's, he's not working. Just remembered, he, yeah, he's, I've had no, some no, trouble. No, I've had some troubles lately. He's oh not my working. god, I'm a professional in this situation. No, I'm sure I've had it a lot, and believe me, nothing you can do. Make it work. No. Nothing you can do. No, 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 nothing nothing you can do. Me. All the best. Take care. No. All right, yeah, yeah, you enjoy no, this. No, 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 no. Bye bye then. No. Bye bye then. Obviously that guy was prepared, he had a condom in his hat. I usually put mine in my shoe, but maybe what, I don't know, a bit, bit too much in the bar. Yeah, a little too presumptuous. <laughs> yeah, okay, come back. <laughs> cool. I wouldn't usually do this, but... Can I ask just one thing? I mean, yeah. it's silly, it's so small, but it's just it's really important to me. Um, okay. I am. Um, could I just, um, if you could just, you know, you're. What? No, no. What the, what's, <laughs> Come what on. You, no, what are you, no. Just stay still. No, what the fuck, no. Jesus I just Christ. want to reply to. Oh. <laughs> You're a good boy. <laughs> You're all right. You're all right. Yeah. 